I forgot to get bullets. Okay, you know what? Uh, you know what? You know what? I'm gonna wait for him to leave, dude. I'm gonna wait for him to leave. Alright, he gone? He gone? Alright. Yeah. Oh, oh, the block is hot. The block is hot. Hold up, bro. Hold up. People running up. People running up. Alright, what is good, YouTube? It's your boy Guaps, and I'm back in with another episode of this Franklin's Millionaire Empire. And you guys see it. We got our boy Lamar over here at the shop. And you probably already know why. And judging by the green jailbreak red eye that's behind me, we're going to be giving him the keys to this. I actually thought about it over like the past like week. No lie. I was like, okay, now I'm stuck with this green red eye. I already have my black one. I already know what I want to do with the black one. So I'm like, what am I going to do with this? So I was thinking about turning it into a stash car or whatever or some type of like getaway car or something but I thought about it wait a minute why not I actually call up Lamar and actually give him the keys to it it's already paid for and everything plus um like he always be saying I don't do anything for him which apparently that is not the case considering I saved him his life so many amount of times in the story mode but I digress I digress but anyways like also while we on the topic uh, I actually found a place for him to actually deal for us he's actually still out here like doing uh, like dealing uh, drugs and whatnot so um, I actually just found out that house 55 is just got done so we actually can go up here and go and check it out so this used to be house 293 so but we actually renovated it into house 55 and you're gonna see why so anyways um we actually over here at the shop and matter of fact let's actually take a little bit of a rundown of what we got going on so we got a couple workers a couple workers out on lunch right now uh, but anyways you you already see the lineup of what we're working with so i'm actually gonna go first i'm gonna start off with the charges first now first of all if you guys didn't see the episode where we took delivery of the last call 2023 jailbreak hellcat and hellcat red eye charger wild bodies like go go back and watch it bro go back and watch it i go full in depth with this with both of these actually because um like i said it is available in my discord which is going to be down in the description down below but I got four versions of these cars, two Hellcats and two Red Eyes, and both, all four of them have is extremely detailed. It's safe to say that I have the best Red Eye Charger model on in in GTA. Period. So it's no discussion. So, anyways, the first thing that I did when uh, excuse your boy when I brought these back to the shop was actually had the tents put on here. So I got blacked out tents on mine, and I got blacked out tents for Lamar's. And the one thing that I also did was I had to have him go to the DMV and get his uh, license plate or like get his license plate in general. I don't know where he's running to over there, but I told him to get his license plate and then we put it on his charger um, that we given him. So all I just got to do is give him the keys to it and then it's pretty much his. Now, and then I also, I know I didn't go in depth with this. I'm going to make another in depth video on this one, but this is going to be Franklin's Demon Charger. Now, I am thinking about selling it, but I am going to like ride around in it, like, you know, just because. And then I'm thinking about selling it. So a couple people came by looking at it. It was like, bro, like, what's the deal with this? So it's a demon swap. So if you guys didn't know, like a few episodes ago, I dropped off the 2018 charger, and um, one of my uh, workers actually found a demon engine for sale. And it wasn't at an auction or anything. It was actually just for sale because somebody told it out their demon, and all, the only thing that was left was the engine. So like, we actually went, been able to put the demon engine in it. We just gotta like test it and make sure because right now it's not starting so it's right now it's just sitting here collecting dust but as for the hellcat engine that was in here i'm thinking about buying a chrysler 300 i know someone said in the comments but i'm gonna buy a chrysler 300 just so we can put the uh hellcat engine that we got laying around here uh in it and do a full hellcat swap i already know what i'm about to do to it so and we also did the seats into it we got the updated seats and everything and we put the wide body fenders on it now the one thing i did want to do is i want to put the wide body oem fenders on it but i also wanted to keep the front end on it too with the 2019 uh snorkel grills that's the one thing i wanted to do it looked nice it looked nice with this wrap that we got on it with the stripes and everything and of course we have the mustang that's still over here the parts just came in so they're actually going to put go go to work on it today while i'm while i'm gone and someone dropped off their Cayenne uh, Turbo S Coupe over here. And they wanted to put, they wanted it on 22 inch Ford Giados, um, black and white. So honestly, the black and white contrasts really good with the interior. 
Like, honestly, this was honestly a good choice on their part. Like, they got a good taste. And also, someone dropped off the C7 Corvette. The only thing they wanted to have done to it was a Stage 1 kit. And then they also wanted to put it on HREs. So, they got the Z06 on HREs. And we also got a Stage 1 kit. We just got to take it on a test drive uh, once we're finished. Just a small little tune. Nothing major. They just wanted a little bit more power on it. Because I think the Z06s on the C7s, I think it's like... 500 horsepower because I know the ZO the ZL1 or the ZR1 is I think 600 horsepower 700 around that range um I forgot I got to get up on game of my Corvettes but here's my favorite part now y'all already know I'm a midnight club boy until I die like I haven't forgot about my tuners and my JDM cars so this guy dropped off both of his supers he got the mark 5 and he got the mark 4 so I'm jelly I'm really jealous because I'm still waiting on my super and my skyline to come in it's on back order so and like they having a problem with the shipping company and everything so anyways he wanted to have the paint matching and the, on the Mark V, he got a Stage 2 kit put on it and a new, uh, some new body kits put on it and some, I think these are Volks uh, wheels. Yeah, these are Volks because I remember these rims was, was in Midnight Club Los Angeles. And he also wanted to have the shopping list, list liveries on it and then he wanted to have a custom license plate, which is what we're waiting on. Then he can come and pick it up. Now, the Super Mark IV, he wanted to do something crazy to it and something unique to it. So, not only is it paint matching, but it also has uh, two 15-pound bottles of NOS in it. He has the subwoofers in the back. He has uh, the airbags in the back as well. And the bride, uh, uh, the bride seats on it as well for both the racing seats. Now, the Sparkos, he has Sparkos in the front. And then he has the bride uh, interior for the back seats and on the door panels. So, this is actually sick. And plus, he has a body kit on it. He had a Sea West uh, spoiler on it. Matter of fact, let me put this down just so I can show you what it would look like. And he also got that uh, Too Fast, Too Furious Slapjack Super Hood on it too with the uh i forgot uh what body kit this is but he wanted to have a different body kit and of course you guys see that 2jz engine in there this is the 2jz so this thing is pushing out like i would say 700 horsepower he wants to have it pushing a thousand but then he doesn't want to put them drag radios on but then he also put the bell side we also gave him the bell side wheels too i already know what i'm going to do with my supra once it comes in and i already know what i'm going to do with my nissan z that's about to come in or like what i'm about to drop off at benny's once my gtr is done but anyways that's all that we working with for right now so now we can actually go on and take Lamar's uh, charger out and then what I'm gonna do is since this is gonna be a trapping episode what I'm actually gonna do is I'm gonna take my jailbreak out uh, I'm gonna drop his car off because I, I think I'm about to let him stay at house 55 for a little bit just for tax reasons and I'm actually gonna come back to the shop get my charger and then we're gonna go order some drugs if Z has some and we're gonna go out on the streets and trap for a little bit so let's actually get into Lamar's charger actually unlock mine by mistake I'm saying this thing is nice because it got the red guts in it and everything it's the F8 green with them red guts is nice bro all right bro all right hop in so honestly this is gonna be a little bit of a fun episode I'm not gonna go lie last episode we got into a shootout hopefully it won't uh, become that time also I keep forgetting I also have to do this because the transmission is broken in GTA they gotta fix that all right so anyways let's fill her up honestly I gotta do something about these is that a dealer over there if that's a dealer that is she's holding a shotgun in her hand look at it bro uh, you know what I don't play this bro I don't play this hold on dog uh-uh uh -uh. I don't play this All right, Lamar, we gotta go, we gotta go, right now. We gotta go, right now, back in the car, back in the car, back in the car. I just had to take care of that, bro. I just had to take care of that. He's like, bro, and I thought I was crazy. You wanna talk about me being crazy? Bro, shut up. All right, so anyways, I keep forgetting. There's also, they also put the gas station over there too. There's a new gas station over here. So they, um, like the park is like renovated out. They redid the park and they put a gas station over there. Uh, oh my god, and I forgot, I put the cops on patrol back in, I put the cops back in my game, oh boy, 
So now, now we gotta be extra, extra careful now. Alright, so matter of fact, let me set the waypoint and he's about to pull me over. Yep, he about to pull me over. Okay. Alright, let's pull over right over here, see what he wants. Hey, bro, where are you going? <laughs> he ran, bro! <laughs> he jumped out, bro! Where's he going? Bro, Lamar, what are you doing? You're about to get me in trouble! What, <laughs> what was that about? you about to get me in trouble, dog! Bro, it ain't over me. I was only doing 58 in the 45. I mean, it was nothing major. I mean, it was really nothing major. Anyways, also, do I have... Did I freeze the time in the game? Yes, I sure did. All right, let me freeze, unfreeze the time. Only 260. Yeah, you thought I was somebody else, wasn't it? You thought I was somebody else because I'm a black person in a charger, huh? Huh? Jag off. All right, so anyways. um, So, now we're going to go and visit this house. We're going to have a whole house tour, too. Oh, nope, nope. Okay, he chasing somebody. He chasing that low rider. He ain't chasing us. All right, so now I gotta be extra careful when I'm out doing my thing. I gotta be extra careful. Cause like now there's cops on every single on every single street. Like I gotta find out the right mod where I can put at least some cops at least every now and then. It's that same cop again too. Uh oh. Hold on, bro. Hold on. Bro, I know, that's what I'm saying, bro. Oh, oh, they killed him. Oh, they killed him. Oh, uh oh. Oh, hold on, bro. Hold on, bro. We gotta go. We gotta go right now. Bro, and Lamar, Lamar's flipping them off. Lamar's flipping them off, bro. Okay, anyways, now that we over here, finally, we, the main reason why I went over here because it was peaceful. Now, now we got shootouts over here too. All right, but anyways, we at house 55 and everything. And this is where gonna be Lamar is probably gonna be staying. I'm gonna let him crash over here whenever he's not at his crib down in the hood. So let's actually go and check out the house and everything. I'm just have, gonna have him stay like right here. Matter of fact, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna let him work right here. I'm actually just gonna let him stay like right here. Okay, so I'm gonna let him work so he don't follow me. All right. So. Now we now we at house 55. Matter of fact, let me get a couple screenshots of this actually. Let me get a couple screenshots just in case if I want to get a thumbnail. Alright, so now that I took care of that, and then also, uh, I also forgot about that. They also have an extension. That's the main reason why I bought this house. So we're gonna take a look at that in a second. But right now, we're actually gonna go take a little bit of a tour house tour right now. So Lamar's just gonna stay outside while he admires his new car that I gave him. So the first thing I wanted to do above anything else was that I wanted to have the garage renovated out so I have room for three cars. One in the back uh, where the jack is and, and the lift is and two in the front. And then I can block off this garage with other cars. So this is the one thing I wanted to have because the last time 293 uh, while we were over here it was a two car garage it wasn't a three car so I could fit three cars in here if I wanted to. So I already ordered my tool kit, my tool chest and everything and all that good stuff and uh, got the engine swap jack. I can convert this into my own little garage if I really wanted to. Just cut, have a couple of the workers from the shop come over. And going inside, we have the washer and dryer and the uh, closet that's over here. It's a little bit tight, but honestly, you're going to see why it's worth it. You're going to see why it's worth it. So, you got the kitchen. So, that's right here. Honestly, uh, Franklin don't really cook all that much. But when he does, like he doesn't really like need a whole lot of space. So, And then also, this is what I also like is that the refrigerator and, and the microwave and the... Um, the uh, to toaster oven and all the seasoning stuff is like right in the wall so it's they actually drilled the holes in and then they put it inside the wall so that's actually nice got a small uh, little one of those like Starbucks coffee table top tables that's over here you go you know when you go to Starbucks or Dunkin Donuts they have like these small square tables for like two people and then now that we got the living uh, area set up and the living area it got the 50 inch on the wall we got a small dining table that's over here like it's small don't get me wrong but honestly it's worth it and then of course what I had to do is I had to get security cameras this is gonna be like my 
temporary base for right now until like we start looking at other like penthouses and all that good stuff so for now this is going to be like our main house for like our base of operations so now uh the one thing that i also like is they also installed one of those like apple play like uh wall mounts where like you know when like you go into like an airbnb or like some type of fancy schmancy house or whatever and then they have like this tablet on the wall and you can change the temperature you can play music and ambience throughout the whole entire house uh and it's connected to the fire pit and everything and honestly I, that's one of my favorite features right here then right here just got a small bathroom nothing major and then going outside the whole house is renovated we have like a small uh we have a small grilling area right here we have a garden and then also here's my favorite part we also uh, the garden is extended so not only is there a path right here we also have our privacy wall right here you come in here you go right up to the front door and then when you go up to the front door here's my um one of my other favorite features of this house right here this door opens and then we have a small pool area right here now like i said it's not the smallest or like not the biggest like a uh, house 47 or like our other house that's like down over here by the beach but dude like right here this is all we really need if i'm gonna be honest with you so now what i'm also gonna show is upstairs now upstairs is where the magic really happens now going upstairs we have some art on the wall you know when you have a nice house you have to have art on the wall it's basic principle but right here we have our uh, gaming setup right here this is my favorite part so we have our internet uh, router and modem like all set up right right here we got a whole ethernet tower right here and then right here we have our gaming setup and our streaming setup we have our plaques on the wall and everything uh, sign plaques from Dr. Dre and everything and then we have of course we have our widescreen 60 inch that's like right here on the wall above the setup so say if I'm done streaming or whatever I can just watch TV or I can just hook up the uh, PlayStation up here and then I can just play whatever I want so honestly this is my favorite part right here and going into up here I think this is the bedroom yeah this is the master bedroom so this is um the master bedroom right here this is where we have our closet this is where our bathroom is where our shower and tub and everything now the only thing that i don't really like is that this uh there's a whole window right here where the camera is so i'm actually have to get some like privacy blinds and everything so like we can have our privacy but honestly that's this is honestly a really good setup right here and then of course we have the toilet and then the sink right here and I think there's like two other bedrooms too. So here's also our wardrobe that's right here. Oh yeah, and this is my favorite part. Our jewelry collection and then our, this is like our secret like little compartment right here. We have our rollies, we have our jewelry right here. And we have our travel bags. And then we have our cash uh, stash up there at the very top. And then you won't really notice it until like you really walk up to it. That's really nice. And then going into the other room. Now, I'm trying to figure out if there's anything else. Okay, this downstairs. This is where we just came from. Uh, this is the bathroom, right? Uh, no. This is... Uh, oh, yeah, I almost forgot. This is the second guest bedroom. So, uh, right here is the other guest bedroom. So, like, other people, like, when they over, they can stay right here and everything. And then what does this door go to? Oh, yeah, of course. This is the other bathroom right here. Like, I don't even know what my house look like, bro. All right, but really, that's really about it for this house bro I actually like this house for one reason is because of the streaming setup and also what I'm also gonna show you outside so now once you go outside now I'm gonna show you where my favorite part of like this whole house well the main reason why I wanted to get this house I forgot that's the bathroom and you go outside and then you go through the gate and this is also this comes with the house so no this isn't public parking or nothing this comes with the house so this is our property uh this is still our property line right here like we have our own garage space outdoor garage and to like store our cars i can fit so many cars over here dude it's ridiculous i i can already see the potential baby i can already see the potential so right here um this is where like uh our 
cameras are hooked up and everything we got cameras so if anybody get wise to see on um, like what type of cars i'm parking over here and like my car collection i have cameras set up right here on angles and on a swivel and then also i have more cameras that's up there and i have another camera that's also where's the other one at i forgot where it's at but i think it's somewhere else around here but i can fit so many cars i can fit two over there like three right here three right here i can fit one more and two actually i can fit two right here and then i can uh just park any other car i want like in this space over here so the we have potential baby so anyways that's the house um tour for house 55 and everything lamar's just gonna stay right here and all that good stuff so um now that we got that done we can go back to the shop and get our charger we can go uh ammo shopping because i forgot we forgot to go get ammo and all that good stuff so we're gonna go ammo shopping and everything so i'm gonna call these people and give me a ride and everything and lamar's gonna handle his business he's gonna be dealing uh with us and honestly i might let him have a bigger cut of what he's taking home versus everybody else we might just split it like uh 50 50 or like uh 60 40 he gets 60 so anyways he's making good money but he just wanted like now that he's with me we're gonna be making some big boy plays so let me call these people and let me get a ride back to the shop and then uh we can go off with our All right, people now that we got the plate put on here we can actually go on and uh what, what we were actually about to do so matter of fact what time is it actually first of all before i do Oh my god, that startup Hemi will never get old. It will never get old. So it's 15, uh, that's like 5 o'clock. So uh, we, we're we making a decent time. We're making decent time. So matter of fact, before I do anything else, I just got to do that because the transmission's broken. I can't stress that enough. That's not me fiddling around with the um, mod menu just because. Dude, I love this red eye, bro. No lie, this is like my favorite car on earth besides the GTR. The Nissan GTR, but bro, I, I cannot wait until I get my money right and get one of these, bro. Jesus Christ! But before we do anything else, I gotta go and get some guns. I gotta go and get some gun ammo. All right, so I'm let me park my car like right here, and the doors are open too. Well, what is you on about? Alright, 900. I could have sworn I could have carried some more uh, ammo, but whatever. Alright, hold on. Uh, I don't know what he's on about, but I just got to get some ammo like right here. I could have sworn I could have got some more uh, bullets or something. Alright, hold on. They got another, they got a different type of gun in here. Honestly, they actually look kind of, look kind of cool. All right, so, um, yeah, I might come back and see, like, that other, like, Commando or, like, that PDW that they got. I don't even remember what type of guns I even have in my, um, in my, what you call, in my game. Because I know I got the, um, tw uh, I got the AA-12. No, this ain't the AA-12. This is something else. But I know I got the AK-47. I got the AR-15. I got the... Or this could be an M4 if I'm going to be mistaken. Then I got the MTAR. Uh, I didn't replace the sniper rifles. I didn't replace, replace the LMGs. I got the P90. I got the SCAR-17. And then I also replaced a couple other things. Oh yeah, I got the FAMAS in here. And then I also have... there's uh, There was another weapon that I replaced. Oh yeah, the pistols. So, of course, I have the real-life Desert Eagle. I have the... Uh, the Beretta 9mm. I have the Glock. Uh, oh yeah, I forgot. I needed one of these because I gave one of these to my dealer. As a matter of fact, I might put a suppressor on this one. Oh man, matter of fact, I can't because I forgot I replaced it. But I got the Glock 17. I got the Glock with the switch. This is my baby right here. So, matter of fact. Okay, so yeah, I got the Glock with the switch. And then I got the Ruger 5.7. Or the Smith & Wesson 5.7. So yeah, I gotta uh, go through and see like what other guns I need to put in my game. But now that we actually got that situated, let me see if Z is going to re-up soon. Let me see if Z is going to re-up. So, let me see. If he's uh, got some drugs on him, I can actually go and order some. Okay, he said that he's going to re-up Saturday. 
Oh, he's gonna re-up Saturday. Okay. So now he's actually texting me uh, when he's actually gonna go and get some drugs. Matter of fact, I think I got drugs on me anyway. So yeah, I can actually uh, work with what I got. So I think what I'm gonna do is I might post up where I usually post up and then we're actually gonna go uh, right back uh, to business. Now, hopefully the cops don't really uh, bother us all that much, but we'll post up right here for now. We'll post up right here for now. Because honestly, this is our spot right here. As a matter of fact, we'll go and post up on uh, Family Turf. We're actually going to go on Family Turf and post up. Bring the red eye to the hood, baby. All right, some people are uh, already running up. And like, I know what some of you are going to say. Like, why don't you take off the splitter guards? Why don't you take off the splitter guards? Hey, it's my car. It's my choice. Plus, like, it's not going to stay on here forever. It's not going to stay on here forever. Actually, it's something about having these splitter guards on the charger or like on an RT and above. I just had to let people know that this is a Mopar. They don't do this on any other car, just so you know. Oh, and we just got paid for our businesses, too. We just got paid for our business. We got paid 100K. Uh, somebody wants to play for 2400 Thank you. All right, so we'll actually post up like right here. Hold up, bro. Somebody's being chased. I was spotted when I was dealing. I didn't even do anything. Hold on. Okay, the area isn't all that hot, if I'm going to be honest. The area isn't too hot, so it's really not that bad. But I just want to trap out just for a little bit more before we go and drop this thing off just so we can get some work done. So I got to go and make these plays real quick. They're just right around the corner from each other. So that's the good part. Like, bro, I'm on the west side, bro. Don't try me. Ain't even wa nobody worry about no east side. Did he have an English accent or something? He said, oh, oi, thank you. All right, bro, and one thing I'm going to do to this jailbreak is I'm going to have a beefy muffler, uh, mid muffler delete on this, bro. Uh, one thing I'm also going to do is I'm going to put a leg maker on here. I'm going to have a mid muffler delete and all that stuff, bro. This thing is going to scream and holler. Now, one thing that people been telling me, like, the mid muffler delete sounds better than, like, a straight pipe. Now, I thought the straight pipe sounded the best, if I was going to be honest. But, honestly, to me, the mid muffler delete sounds the best. Alright, people want $200. What is it with these $200 plays, bro? I might go up uh, to downtown. That's where the real money is at. Right, I'm gonna take that play for like $2,400, I think it was. Alright, what time is it? So it's. What, what is it? 9? 9 o'clock? It can't be 9 o'clock, right? It don't get this dark at around 9 o'clock in the afternoon. Anyway, I'm working. I'm working, man. I'm working right now. All right. Now, let's actually go over here and see what this dude wants. Oh, I keep forgetting. He's up. He's down there in the river, isn't he? He's down here in the river, isn't he? He sure is. Matter of fact, let me text him down here and tell him to bring his butt up here. I ain't driving down there in my new car. There we go, right there, bro. It took you long enough. I know I should not be trapping like this out in the open, but I can't help myself. 
bro. I cannot get over these peanut butter seats in here, man. I cannot get over these peanut butter seats. I wanted uh, one with the red guts, but I was like, you know what? Let me do something a little bit different and get the peanut butter seats instead. You know what I might do is I might post up at this gas station like right here. Matter of fact, yeah, that's exactly what I gotta want to do. Like I got a couple people like uh, posted up actually. Yeah, I'm gonna post up like right here. I'm gonna leave the engine running and everything. And then he wants some cocaine. Luckily for you, I got some. 80 bucks. $200. You got someone. You know what? Never mind. Bro, like, ain't nobody got no money out here, bro. I don't know what I'm about to do. I might go up to Mirror Park. Hold up, bro. Hold on. I don't play this. Hold on. Where's my Draco at? Where's my Draco? Where's my Draco? Oh, I could have sworn I bought more bullets. I didn't get no bullets for this thing. Dang it, I forgot to get bullets. Okay, you know what? Uh, you know what? You know what? I'm gonna wait for him to leave, too. I'm gonna wait for him to leave. Alright, he gone? He gone? Alright. Yeah! Oh, oh, the block is hot. The block is hot. Hold on, bro. Hold up. People running up. People running up. Hold on. Ball is trying to run up? Come on. Right, come on, come on, come on, come on, bring it. Is he dead? Hold on. I thought this was. Bro, the whole block is coming up here. The whole block is coming up here. Hold on, hold on, bro. I don't play this. Hold on. Yeah, ha, ha. you got hit by a car. Uh, I did not mean to throw that, actually. I don't know who they shooting at over there. This thing barely got any range on it, too. We done? Hold on. Somebody's still shooting at me. All right, we gotta move. We gotta move it right now. We gotta move. All right, that got hectic real quick. Real quick, fast, and in a hurry. In fact, let's go to uh, Vago's territory and see uh, who got the real money over here. In fact, some people want some uh, plays right here. A couple plays like right here. I keep forgetting this is also Vago's. So they like literally a block. Their ops is literally down around the corner. What's the deal? Like, dude, literally their enemies is like literally right there down the block. They must got a truce going on or something. Hey, I might post up like right here. I'm gonna post up like right here. All right, come on. Somebody has to have some money over here, bro. Uh, I know it's like, okay, what time is it? Okay, if 23 is 11, so 22 is 10, 21 is nine okay so now it's nine o'clock okay i don't know why i'm getting my military time screwed up bro just go around jesus christ go around bro move move it bro uh, what's, what's happening with you How you living? i'm living real good really good And they nada to you. They nada. 
I almost forgot uh, Spanish right there for a little bit. Bro, can these people just go around? It's not that difficult. Look at all this space you got. Good God Almighty, bro. Uh, we didn't get spotted or nothing. They said that they spotted us, but like right now the block isn't really hot or nothing. Hey, honey, how's it going? Thank you, honey. All right, come on. Uh, what else we got? We making some good money. I gotta remember. I gotta uh, deposit this money too. Perfect. Hold on, bro. Hold on. What, what is she? Where is she going? Oh she, oh, she just wants some drugs. I'm about to say, like, she about to get out the car and start squabbling or something. Alright. I don't know what he was talking about. I'm like telling you, bro, you don't want these problems. You don't want these problems. I'm telling you that now. Come on, bro. Hold on, bro. We can get the tussling, bro. We can get the tussling. Yeah, that's right. Oh, Z re up, Z re up. Perfect. That's exactly what we're gonna do. So, matter of fact, all right. So, matter of fact, that's exactly what we got to do. So, Z, and then we're gonna order some drugs since I got a, a couple million on me right now. All right. So, let's see what we got here. We're gonna order a million dollars worth of weed. We're gonna order all the crack, and then we're gonna order all the coke. All right, place the order for 1.7 milli, and then I'll untrack this, make this mustache vehicle, and then we can go. Come on, bro! You know what? I can get to tell some. This is my new car, bro. Yeah, 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 yeah. What you want? What? What you? Hold on, hold on. We can get the tussling in the street now. It ain't nothing to me. It ain't nothing to me. It ain't nothing to me, boy. Yeah. Get knocked out like your daddy used to. Yeah, get knocked out like your daddy used to. Hey. Nick. Come on. What you want to do? What y'all want to do? Come on. Y'all want to jump? Y'all getting washed right now. Y'all getting washed right now. Y'all get washed, boy! Hey! You got a knife, bro! What you want? Yeah, what you thought? What you thought this was? Come on! Come on! Bro, you still ain't! Hey! Hey! You got me stun rock! What y'all wanna do? Come on. Come on. We can get the tussling in the street now. It ain't nothing to me. I'll get it washed. I don't drop seven of your boys. Get up, bro. Come on. I just quit frowning, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, hey! See, I was waiting for this to happen. Uh uh, no, where are you going? Come on. I, I didn't mean to do that. I didn't mean to do that. Come on. I was expecting for this to happen. I was expecting for this to happen. Come on. All this because somebody scratched my car and then they want to act like it's my fault. Come on. Who's that? Yeah. I don't give no damn name. What, the, what is up with people today, bro? 
Bro, that was ridiculous, bro. That guy out of hand real quick, bro. Thank goodness I had armor on. And people were out here running in the middle of the street, too. Come on, move it, people, move it. Alright, so now I got the 1.7 million cash on me right now, so we're just going to take these drugs and we're going to take this back to my stash house. Matter of fact, I might just keep it on me. Actually, no, I can't because it's not cut up. I can't uh, sell uncut drugs. I keep forgetting. Alright, let me go put this in my car. We still got 8 million on us. We, uh, we got more than enough money. And plus, we still got the money that's in our bank account. Matter of fact, let me go check my bank uh, balance real quick. Yeah, because this was from story mode. We still got 150 million on us, bro. 150 million. And you're like, if we got 150 million, why are we out here in the streets? I mean, well, because of GTA, that's for one reason. And plus, Franklin said himself, he missed getting his hands uh, dirty. So I'm doing him a favor. Alright, and matter of fact, let me save the game real quick because I never know what can happen uh, when uh, not saving my game. Alright, now let's actually head over to the stash house. Surprisingly, the cops isn't really on patrol, at least not from what I've seen. They was like mostly downtown. I'm like, why are they mostly downtown from what I've seen? And then, from what I've noticed when I was down here, I did not see not one cop aside from like the random time they chasing somebody. Tanya, you're supposed to be working! You're supposed to be working, girl! Get back to work! Alright, so let me go and get these uh, drugs up out of here. And then after we get the drugs out of here, we'll just uh, ma unmake this our stash car, and then we'll just uh, track it again. Okay, so we'll take everything out of here. 700 ounces. That's like 50. That's like I think that's like 60 pounds worth of weed. Uh, maybe, maybe even more. But really, I think I I think it's time I really get a stash car too. I think it's time that I get a stash car. Alright, let's go inside our stash house. It's like 2 o'clock in the morning. Nobody should be watching us. And someone that took my furniture again. Alright, whatever. Alright, I'm gonna stash this. In fact, let's stash everything and then we'll cut this up. And then we'll take some drugs for ourselves. And then take. Dude, we got a lot of drugs in here, dude. Like, honestly, like, we should be set for a while. I, we should be set for a long while, actually. I'll take 2,700 ounces. Then I'll take a little bit of this. I'll take a little bit of that. Yeah, we'll do 2,700 each. We'll do 2,700 each. Alright, and matter of fact, we'll stash our money too while we're at it. I think we only just need like really like a couple hundred thousand in our pocket. So yeah, we'll put like uh we'll put the rest of our money in here. We'll put like seven million here, and then we'll go and go out on the streets in a little bit and make our money then. Now, how much money we got? We got 100k? Okay, that's more That's more than perfect. Okay. Alright, let's exit up out of here. At least my stash house is working today. I don't know what's the deal, what's been the deal with my stash house as of recently. Alright, and then let's unmake this my stash car and then let's track it. Perfect. And matter of fact, next episode, I'll go off and I'll drop some drugs off to our dealers. Because I have no clue uh, how, uh, if they ran dry or not. They don't text me. They don't tell me or anything. They just expect me to, like, come around. 
and give them stuff. But like, just tell me if you run and draw, bro. That's all you have to do is just tell me when you run and draw. Oh, I almost had it too. I almost had it too. Y'all saw it. I really hate that manual transmission is outdated. Like, because this new update, manual transmission is now uh, outdated and everything. Matter of fact, let me go inside ammunition and get this ammo. Because the maker himself on five mods said, like, he can't really work on it right now. So, for now, it's outdated until, like, they put out an update patch to fix uh, the dealership. Uh, not the dealership, but the transmission mod. Not this guy again. Damn! I'll just be I mean, well, I can't, I can't really talk, uh, I can't really talk to myself, bro, because the price of living has gone so up. I can't really blame him because the price of living has gone, gone up so much. Alright. Oh yeah, I forgot they got the uh, M16 with the uh, grenade launcher attachment. Oh yeah, this is the goal right here. This is the goal, like right here with the underbarrel attachment. This is what I'm gonna, uh, gonna pick up one of these days. And then let's see. Uh, I forgot I put a couple other guns in the game too I keep forgetting what I put in what else did I put in okay that's always been in there but dude I gotta uh, figure out oh yeah I think it's because let me check hold on let me check something like really quick uh, I can't do it right now hold on let me go outside let me go outside Oh gee, no wonder why I can't purchase full ammo. I don't have my shooting maxed out on this save file. Oh boy, oh boy. Anyways, uh, I might just have to cheat a little bit and then do... Is that another dealer over there? You know what? If that's another dealer, he looked like a dealer too. Look at how he's posted up. Look at how he's staring at me. Hold on, bro. If he, if he moves, bro, I know how these dealers move. If he, if he moves... If he moves, I'm just waiting on him. I'm watching him like a hawk. So if he moves or anything like that, bro, I'm airing this Draco out. If he moves, I'm airing this Draco out. Yeah, do something stupid. I'm watching you. You think I'm not watching you, but I'm just going through my trunk right now. Now, I'm watching him, bro. I'm watching him. All right, let me just close the trunk. He might not just be a dealer, actually. But he, but uh, the main reason why I know he's a dealer because I like, know other NPC um, post up the way that he's posted up. But matter of fact, I'm gonna go over there. I'm gonna go over there anyways. I'm gonna go over there anyways. Is he a dealer? I might be tripping or something. He might not just be a dealer. I might just be tripping. All right, let me unlock my bad bubby right here. Honestly, I might end off this episode like right here. I'm gonna I'm gonna trap for just a little bit more, and then we're gonna go since it's morning. Since it's morning now, technically we've been up all night, so we might just trap out for a little bit more, and then we'll go and end off this episode. And then I'm gonna record another episode after this. Matter of fact, let's go up to Mirror Park for a little bit. And that'll give me a chance to break this thing in, too. Woo! I threaded the needle right there. Good thing I slowed down before there was a cop, too. Hold on. Who's shooting? Bro, like, bro, we know, you know that we in the hood. Just random shootouts, bro. They shooting at the cops and everything. 
Hold on, I kind of want to watch. I kind of want to watch. Bro, they killed him! Oh, bro, they shooting at him now. Bro, who are they shooting at? Oh, hold on, bro. Hold on. That they, they just wilding out, aren't they? Hold on, I want to see. I'm curious now. I want to see how this ends. I want to see how this ends. Oh, they crashed out. They crashed out. They crashed out. Oh, there you go. They crashed out. They crashed out. Oh, let's see this. Let's watch this. Let's watch this. Watch this. Watch this. Watch this. Oh wait, they jumped out. Oh, they families. Oh, they recognize each other. <laughs> okay, time to go. I'm about to say, bro. Like they shot at the cops and everything. They killed a cop. All right, now that we up here in Mirror Park, let's call Z and uh, spread the word. I know there's also a couple houses I also wanted to check out too. That's over here, but we'll do that another time. Are we getting pulled over right now? Bro, as soon as I talk crap, bro. As soon as I talk crap. Alright, Copper, what you want? You don't want to get me angry too. You wouldn't like me when I'm angry. Trust me, you wouldn't like me when I'm angry too. It's only a little minor speeding incident. Okay. A little $300 ticket. I'll eat that up for breakfast. I brought life. Bro, the other day, also story time real quick. I had Giordano's. I ordered some Giordano's before the winter storm hit over here. Bro, like Giordano's got to be my new favorite spot now. Like, bro, the pizza was only 32 bucks, bro. Only 32 bucks for, like, a medium Giordano's deep dish pizza. Oh, my God, it was so good. Thanks. So, I think that's what I'm going to do. I sold to a cop. So, um, I think that's what I'm going to do from now on. Whenever I go, uh, whenever Like a Dragon uh, Infinite Wealth comes out or when it comes out on the 26th, I'm going to order a pizza all to myself. I'm going to order a pizza all to myself and then uh, for like 30 bucks because I already pre-ordered the game and everything. I'm just waiting for the 26th to roll around and then I already got the day off and everything. I'm going to be playing it all day, all night. I'm going to wake up good and early too like I did for Like a Dragon Gaiden. So I'm going to be up at like 5 o'clock in the morning. I'm going to be up at like 5 o'clock in the morning. The Giordano's don't open up until like I would say 10 o'clock, 11 o'clock. So I mean I got time to kill until then but i'll order my pizza and then i'll run out and i'll carry it out and all that good stuff all right this might be my last play because like things are kind of slow right now things are kind of slow right now i'm not even gonna lie to you guys all right he wants some coke all right don't do it all at once bro i'm telling you they say black don't crack and i don't want you to be uh the non-example uh, 200 bucks? Nah, uh, nah, it's not worth it. But with that being said, bro, we gonna end this off right here, bro. And all that good stuff. We got somebody else running up and all that good stuff. So I'm gonna end off this video right, right here, and then I'm gonna pick up like right where I leave off in the next recording. So uh, until the next time, this your boy Guap. Make sure you guys like and subscribe if you new. And like I said, my jailbreak is in my Discord down below. And I'm out, bro. Deuces. Thank you.